I asked him, he said he had really no idea of the time. He said probably about be at least an hour. I got our little baby Eleanor here with me. She's been talking and snuggling and having the best time. Uh -huh. She's happy, she's fed, and now she's just talking and stretching. Sorry, it's a little loud, the dishwasher's going, but you guys, today is my last day here in New York, and I'm so sad. I've just been in this little bubble with Shell and Nate and little baby Nora, and I'm so sad to leave, because it's just been so fun. I've really tried just to soak in every moment I can, huh? Because we never get this time back. It's so crazy. I think the next time I see her, they're thinking they're gonna come out to Florida maybe in the next month. They are headed actually to Utah next week to spend some time with family. And then after that, they think they're gonna come to Florida, hopefully, we'll see how it all goes. But I definitely will be seeing her soon, but the next time I see her, she'll probably have grown a ton, which is crazy. So. We're just enjoying this little tiny newborn stage. Hi, oh, sweetie. And it's been so fun. Honestly, it's been so nice just to kind of tune everything out and just focus on this little sweetie, hang out with Shell. I've tried to help them because life with a newborn is no joke. It's a lot of work, but it's so worth it, huh? It's so worth it. So you guys, we are just wrapping up our... Oh, are you going to talk? Are you going to talk? You guys are probably thinking we'd rather see the baby, not Brady, huh? Which is so sweet and so cute. Yes. We're just waking up. <gasps> we can talk to Brady. So I have to leave in about an hour. So we are just soaking in every last little minute together. I made some bread for them this morning and those cinnamon rolls. The last thing they turned out so good. So I'll have to share that recipe with you guys because it is such an easy bread recipe. So quick and so delicious. So that's kind of what's going on over on this part of the world. I'm sure Jared will be checking with you guys in a little bit, but uh, we'll go ahead and just sign out for me and little Miss Nora Jane. Meanwhile. Hey, what's up you guys? I am actually feeling a lot better. You guys can probably tell it in my voice, but the last couple days, in fact, over the weekend, I was not getting any sleep. It is so hard to sleep without Brittany. But I'm so excited, I'm gonna be picking her up here in a little bit. I've tried to clean up the house as much as I possibly can. It's not like it was a pigsty before, but I have definitely kind of gone into beast mode cleaning a little bit. Then I actually took Finn out on a walk this morning when we woke up, and guys, we saw a woodpecker. I've never seen a woodpecker ever before, and we saw one up in the tree. I tried to film a little bit, and the funny thing is that he stopped pecking every time I went to go film him. And then when I turned the camera off, he started pecking again. I was like, oh my gosh. So yeah, we've basically just been taking it easy today. I've been doing a bunch of work stuff, both with my job here as well as with Adventure Hunt. So that's been fun to crank out both of those, but I have worked up an appetite. So I'm gonna cook myself up some eggs. As you guys know, I have not eaten meat yet. It's been over a year that since I've eaten meat, I'm trying to ease my way into it. But I'm gonna try cooking some eggs for myself right now for the first time in no joke in over a year. So hopefully I remember how to do it. This is my first time cracking an egg in over a year. Dang it. <laughs> I forgot how to do it. Oh, that's really good. <laughs> That's not the greatest. <laughs> Well guys, I'm not gonna lie, I think this turned out pretty darn good. Obviously, I'm going to see if I have any shells in here because I might have a couple. <laughs> so as you guys see here, I got my eggs, I got some salsa. This is mango salsa, by the way, it is so good. And then this is that roasted street corn dip that we have that we always love to get from Publix. So I'm gonna eat this, then dive back into some work stuff, and then by that time, it's gonna be time to pick up bread. Oh, 
Okay. <laughs> what does Eleanor have on? You guys, look at this little munchkin. <laughs> Is this not the sweetest? So I gave her this little outfit and we just tried it on. And it fits so cute right now. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> Look how cute she is! <laughs> it matches those pretty little eyes. You're just a little too cute, Eleanor. Aww. You're a little New York, little New York baby. <laughs> so sweet. Oh my gosh. When the sun hits her eyes in that color. Aww. You're just so beautiful. And look at our little mittens. Mommy's so good to make sure she doesn't scratch herself because she yeah. likes to, yes, yeah, she likes to arms. <laughs> across my gate where it's a little more quiet. Hopefully you can hear me. But that was so hard saying goodbye to them. Oh my goodness, you can probably tell. I was kind of a mess in the car and tears coming down my cheeks. Michelle said when she shut the door, she just fell into Nate's arms. Like we are such ball babies. But I'm gonna see them in probably a month. So that's the one thing that's good about this is I will see them soon. But what an amazing trip. It was so special. Spent with my sisters and sweet little Nora. You guys, is she just not the cutest doll? Like, oh, I love her so much. Hard to say goodbye, but memories were made. I'm so glad we got to spend that time together. And now it's time to get back to Florida. I'm so excited to see Jared and my little Finn. I've missed them a ton as well. Sounds like my flight is me boarding here pretty soon. So I will see you in Florida. Just then. Maintenance has gone back. They need to actually look up on a deactivation process. Oh. So we need to fix that all before we take the airplane anywhere. I asked him, he said he has really no idea of the time. He said probably about be at least in an hour. You can actually the plane. And while you're doing that, can you please take the belongings with you? All right, you guys. So as you can tell, I am not in the air right now. Our plane, we were out on the runway and all of a sudden they said we need to go back to the terminal because there were some computer malfunctions. And so we waited there for about half an hour. Then they said it's gonna be about another hour. And then they just told us you can get off the plane if you'd like. So that's all we know right now. I'm not quite sure what's going on. Most people deplane, some people are still on there. So we're kind of just waiting, but it's good that they found the issue at least when we're on the ground and not in the air. <laughs> so trying to have a positive attitude. So hopefully it's not too much longer before I'm able to get on the plane and get home. A little later. All right, you guys, so they had us get back on the plane. We're waiting for an update. At least we're back on the plane. We'll see what happens from here. Brittany's plane is about to land, so we're gonna go hop in the car to go pick her up. Honestly, we cannot be more thrilled because it feels like it's been forever since we've seen her. Let's get mommy. Let's go get mommy. Come on, we're gonna go get mommy. You ready? You ready to go outside? We're gonna get mommy. Okay, so we just got to the airport. We're kind of pulled off on the side of the road right now. I'm just waiting for Britt to pick up her bag and then we're gonna go pick her up. But this little guy could not be more excited. I swear he recognizes the airport now. You excited to pick up mommy? You excited? <laughs> he is so excited, you guys, he cannot wait. Cute little Jared and Finn to come get me. Oh, I'm so excited. 
Feeling excited for mommy to be back? <laughs> oh, we missed mommy, didn't we, Finley? Oh my goodness, I miss my boys. I miss my boys. <laughs> <laughs> Puppy attack. Puppy attack. Oh, yes, she just gave me all the kisses. Yeah. home that was a little crazy experience getting home yeah <laughs> I will say though so they never really ended up telling us exactly what was wrong but I am grateful that they figured it out before we got in the air rather than oh yeah know, having a problem opposite. up in the air that'd be yeah, scary for, for sure. sure so yeah. I was delayed about two hours which yes it's frustrating you're tired you just want to get home mm -hmm. but I made it home safe Yep. sound and that's all that matters and I do have to say the JetBlue Airlines stewardess that was assisting me because my TV was broken too she was so <laughs> nice she was like can I get you another seat like can I get we can give you credit like she was just going above and beyond being so nice and I was just really really impressed with them they were so sweet but anyways I'm home safe and sound oh, it's I good have her back it's so good to be back with my boys. <laughs> and you guys, I had an amazing, amazing trip. It was such a special trip for me and my sisters and our sweet new little niece. So definitely one for the books. If you have not seen our vlogs when I'm out there with Michelle and Nate, you guys, make sure you go back, rewatch them, and also go check out Michelle and Nate over on Instagram at City Burgers if you need your little Eleanor fix. <laughs> she is the cutest yeah. and yes. Yeah, she is adorable. It was so much fun watching that footage and editing it. It was just like, oh my gosh, I can't take enough of this. I know, you guys. Yeah. And we have a new little nephew, little Brixton <laughs> yeah. as well. I cannot wait to meet him. <laughs> Hopefully we can make it out to Utah soon to meet him. But for now, you guys, I think we're going to call it a night. It's been a long day, a good day, but a long day. Mm -hmm. We're back together as a family, so we're just going to enjoy some time <laughs> with all three of us little fins here too. <laughs> You're snuggling. He's here. Don't you guys worry. Thank you so much for coming along with me and for all the sweet comments about Nora and yeah, Michelle. Yeah, you guys were incredible. Like, thank just you. Just the love you have for everyone is so sweet, and it means the world to us. So mm -hmm. thank you for that. You guys, we love all of you. And if you happen to be new to Darren Brett, welcome. Hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed today's video, give us a thumbs up and we'll see you all tomorrow. See you guys, love ya, bye. bye.